for this first form of Lavos. I'll be taking Vash, Bloon, and Novin. My triple raid party, I believe. Because we do actually have a triple tech with them all together. I will probably be learning many, many techs uh, throughout these these parts. So, uh... Expect those to come, and I'll try to show them off a little bit, but do not worry. I do have uh, bonus episodes planned where I will be showing off all the all the text. I'm not exactly sure I'm going to organize it yet, but it will definitely be at least one bonus video because there's, there's a ton of them. Let's take on Lavos in his first form, which is Dragon Tank, I guess. Wait for everybody to get their turn. The part on the right stores energy, and then that means the one on the left uh, restores HP. So the one on the right is the grinder, uh, the main dragon tanks in the middle, and then the one on the left is the head. Yeah, there we go. The parts on the left restore HP. And we've already defeated the head. So we should be able to finish off the rest with just regular attacks here, to be honest with you. Especially if I get a critical on the rainbow. Good lord, let's show off the new Masamune! Doesn't do nearly as much as the rainbow, to be honest with you, but it's still awesome! Go, Masamune! Lavos changes his attack mode again! This time we're up against... Remember the name of this? That's the Bit Guardian and his bits, and his two little bits. So, time to change my party around again. Alright, this time for the Bit Guardian version of Lavos, I'll be taking Vash, Jojo, and Luke. Let's go ahead and take them on. I'll probably be able to finish it in one turn, though. In one move here, I think, though. Ready? Go Dark Matter. If that doesn't work... Jojo can attack next, and then Vash can go. But I assume that the Dark Man is going to finish this guy off. Let's put this down here. So we can see the majesty that is Lavos. Die, die, break down. So he died in one attack. Down he goes. Lavos changes attack mode. Sorry, Jojo, you didn't get a turn that time. But we're up against Hecran. Do you guys remember Hecran? Of course you don't. Let me remind you. Hecarin was the first thing that we fought when we learned magic. Well, the first boss that we fought after we all learned magic. So I've brought my best magic users with us. We have Lamia, Kyra, and Luke here. We are going to be taking them on and casting our magics because he is not, <laughs> not weak against physical attacks. So let's go for our magic. Go Dark Matter. If that's not enough, let's go uh, Ice 2. If that's not enough, we'll go with Flare. Now hopefully... Yeah, not enough, not enough. Hopefully I can go through... Well... Now, say it. But, hopefully I can go... Uh, ke keep going through most of these forms without doing too much healing. Too much healing. Is that going to be enough? Yes, and we've learned dual attacks. Antipode 2, Antipode 3. I'll go... You know what? I'm going to go over them now. Uh, as he changes attack mode again. This time he's going to be... Zombor! Do you guys remember Zombor? <laughs> I barely remember Zombor. Uh, but we have learned uh, two new techs here. Uh, once again, I will show these all off at some point, um, but we have learned Antipode 2, uh, which is Ice 2 and Fire 2, and Antipode 3, which is Ice 2 and Flare. Guess which one does more damage. Uh, for this fight up against Zombor, I'm just going to keep the same party, uh, because, well, it, it, it's weak to magic as well. So hopefully I can take this guy on Shouldn't be too bad, though. Shouldn't be too bad. I believe uh, Dark Matter should take out the part in front here, which is technically the bottom part of Zombor. If I'm wrong, I'm wrong. But I believe... Oh, no. Fuck. <laughs> I did that wrong! Alright. Go, Flare. Now, Flare is, for some reason, I think... Why do I have it in my head that it's a single single attack? It is. It only hits one enemy. Why that is, I don't know. But down goes... Oh, wow. 
okay. But unfortunately, Luke did lose all his MP, so <laughs> he'll probably be gone for a little while while I abuse everybody else's MP. Uh, we're up against uh, Massa and Mune. Massa Mune. You guys remember that at all? <gasps> of course you do! Apparently I took out Lavos's face first. That was weird. That was weird. Alright, time to change my party around a little bit here for this fight against Massa and Mune. Technically, it, there's an and in the middle there. I'm going to be bringing Vash, Kyra, and Lymia. Let's go for it, because, of course, if you remember correctly, this guy's also weak to magic, but I don't have any MP left on, on Luke, so let's go for Luminaire! And then we can show off some, one of the new uh, techniques that we have. I don't believe the Luminaire is going to be strong enough to take uh, well, this form out. It is not. Alright, so we have a chance to show off Antipode. Let's go with Antipode 3. Let's not hold back here. Why would I hold back now? Go Antipode 3. 3,089 damage. But we've learned a couple, well, one new dual tech and a triple tech. Nice. So Fire Sword 2 and Delta Force. And Lavos changes his attack mode again. Oh, Nizbol. I remember Nizbol. You guys remember the secret to Nizbol? <laughs> I'm sure you do. But first, we have learned a couple new, new techs. So let's go ahead and look at those. We have learned Fire Sword 2, which is uh, Fire 2 and confuse and then of course we have learned the triple tech delta force that looks like lightning 2 ice 2 and fire 2 nice well we'll maybe see that well i probably won't use it in battle to be honest with you but it is time for me to take out some party members and replace them with other ones i'm sure you guys understand how that works for this fight against nibble nisbull I think I've actually brought back the party that I fought in this bowl with the first time. I have Vash, Jojo, and Bloom. Let's go and fight him. Now, these fights, as you can see, are not that tough, so I'm not too concerned about it. But, if you remember, this guy was weak to uh, lightning. You need to use lightning. So let's attack him with Volt Bite, and then we can use Uzi Punch. So... I believe that if when you cast lightning on him, it actually hurt. Uh, well, he's not weak to it, but his defensive power has been decreased. So go, Uzi Punch! Not enough for the victory there, unfortunately. But should I want to, and I do, halt all enemies, spin kick. Uh, we can't do beast toss, unfortunately. Uh, let's just go for a triple kick here. And then you can go for... Uh, another oozy punch if that's not enough but I think that is enough nope go for another oozy punch for 1200 more damage and we've learned a triple tech twister nice and Lavos changes his attack mode again who's it gonna be this time it's Luke of course back then we were still calling him mages but damn it it's Luke but we did learn a new triple tech once again. I told you I'd be learning a ton of them here. This time we have learned Twister. This one's going to be a Cyclone from Vash, a oh geez, Laser Spin from Bloon, and what is that from JoJo? <laughs> Damn it! It's another spinning attack. What does she have that's spinning? Tailspin! It's going to be Tailspin from her as well. So everybody's twisting around, which is why they call it Twister. Now, the Luke slash Magus form of Lavos is, is kind of the toughest one that we're going to be facing uh, right now. So hold on while I make sure that I have everything properly prepped. Alright, for this one, I've brought back the team that defeated Magus Luke in the first place. It's going to be Vash, Kyra, and Novin. Let's go for this one. I believe this one is the one that usually gives me trouble, to be honest with you. More than anything else. So, uh, first things first, let's attack 
with the Mass Mune because that's pretty much free damage. Mass Mune drops his uh, drops his magic defense. Let's go for what's it gonna be weak to? Let's try Illuminaire. Forget what he's weak to to start, but if you remember, he actually changes his weakness as you go through the fight. That was not what he was weak to. Okay, barriers change. 